Welcome to Board Game Nation. My name is Gary Blevins. Thank you so much for watching. I recently had the amazing opportunity to talk with legendary game designer Larry Harris. In our conversation, we talked about his 40-year career where he developed more than 200 games for some of the biggest names in the industry. His most famous game? Axis and Allies. Since the original game came out in 1984, it has spawned more than 20 spin-offs and updates, three of which were inducted into the Adventure Board Game Hall of Fame in 1996. Larry's most recent offering is an amazing game called War Room. Let's hear what he had to say about it. Well, I haven't had a chance to play War Room yet. I've seen it in action a couple of times, and it looks it looks really interesting. Uh, maybe we talk about that for a minute and talk about how that that um, well maybe just the, the premise for how that game and how it differs from other Larry Harris games that we'd be familiar with. Well, it's round. <laughs> yeah, that's what I, that was the big thing that I noticed is that it's, that it's a four foot round board. Uh, War Room. Oh, oh, labor of love there the most beautiful game I've ever seen. Um, it, uh, stack, stacking units and so on, uh, expensive, uh, but worth it. Um, what do you want me to say? Uh, it's, um, it's, uh, it's beautiful. It's absolutely stunning game. And, and the, the components and so on, um, the uh, game itself, uh, it is, um, an ex you know, it's an area movement combat World War II game, so by the same guy who designed Axis and Allies, but it's not Axis and Allies. Let's be clear. It's very different, yeah. and it's a different experience. <laughs> and the fact that the world is round has, uh, gives you a whole other feel and perspective of the uh, board that you're playing on, and, of course, it's the same planet, but presented to you in a, in a different way. Right. I mean, it, the, the point of view of the map is straight down from the North Pole. Uh, and, and there's, slanted, there's, right? Yeah, yeah, it's right. And so, like, it it's it takes a second to to figure out, like, okay, so how does where is North America compared to uh, Antarctica? Like, it's just like, wait, hold on, wait. Um, you actually did that? Yeah, I do it all the time. Yeah, it takes me a second to like to get my like. Okay, so I'm here. Where's Where's Moscow from here? Oh, wait, it's it's over here. Right? So it, t it takes a second to. To, to put it together, but uh, but once you understand kind of how the geography of it lays out, it it makes perfect sense. It just takes a second to make the adjustment. Yeah, uh, cool game. Uh, can't say enough good about it. Okay, well, I will definitely make an effort to 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 get some folks together and, and, and give it a go. Is there? I haven't seen an online version for this game yet. Is that does that exist? An online what? An online version for War Room. Is that a, is um, that a thing yet? There, there's, um, there's some, some stuff going on in that. Uh, it won't be a video game per se, but a, a, you know, you, you pick up a piece and you move it with your, with your uh, cursor. And um, Tom's uh, uh, working on that, and it seems to be coming along nicely. And so that will be up and coming. Again, check back, and uh, we'll update you on that. Yeah. Well, fantastic. Again, a big thank you to Larry Harris for taking the time to sit down and talk with us. If you want to see more from that interview, click here. If you're ready to watch the whole thing, here's your link. And if you want to see everything going on with Board Game Nation, click here to subscribe. Again, my name is Gary Blevins. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you next time.